The Northern Lights, eh? I hear they look spectacular. Indeed. The Northern Lights are coloured lights that appear in the sky. Actually, Mrs Chen, the official scientific name is Aurora Borealis. Yes, thank you, Arnold. Would you like to join us? Oh, can we? We'd love to, Gareth. I mean, uh, Commander Gareth. But, uh, duty calls. Aww. Aurora Borealis! More like Aurora Bomby to Sleepies. What's so great about a bunch of silly lights in the sky? Are you kidding, Norman? It's going to be amazing! This is going to be the dullest science trip ever! Unless... All aboard the intergalactic space rocket! Mandy, Sarah, Hannah, James. Oh, where's Norman? <laughs> Greetings, humanoids. I am Normaxo Brisblax, <laughs> extraterrestrial space alien. Sit down, please, Norman. If you don't hurry up, we'll miss the Northern Lights. Ah, yes, the lights. Those are actually vapor trails from my spaceship. <laughs> Normaxo crash landed in the mountains, then assumed the human form of a handsome young red headed earthling. Ha ha! Very funny, Norman. Hello, Normaxo. I'm humanoid James. <laughs> Greetings, Jams. Oh, don't fall for it, James. It's just Norman wearing tinfoil on his glasses. Normaxo finds this humanoid rude. Normaxo is a ninny. I'm not. Ah, uh, too. Mission Control, this is Commander Gareth. Countdown to launch in five, four, three, two. Oops. Oh. Oops. Zombies are getting closer. How would you? Martin, oh! Let me in! Let me in! <laughs> what do you want, Norman? I'm trying to watch a scary zombie movie. I'll tell you what's really scary, Mandy. James and Hannah have turned into Ponty Pandy zombies. They're pondies. <laughs> oh, come on, Norman. Everybody knows that zombies aren't real. Are they? Windows! Quick! Hide upstairs! Oh! Phew! We're safe! Oh. <laughs> Bondi? Huh? You're a Bondi! No, I'm not, Norman. I just think I'm getting sick. That's the first sign of being a Bondi! had a terrible dream that Norman Price threw a flare into the laundry basket and set fire to me house. It wasn't a dream, was it? Norman Price has set off a flare and caused a fire in the Flood's house. Norman Price has set off a flare and caused a fire in the Flood's house.
Elvis and Ellie. You fight the fire from outside, Penny and I will rescue anyone inside. Right, Tom. Oh, the door's blocked. Stand back! They'll be here soon. I know. Let's have Norman's ghost story while we're waiting. OK, but it's not a story. It really, really happened. Yes, Norman. Get on with it. It was a dark and stormy night. Halloween. The ghost of Pontypandy was wandering the empty streets, clanking his chains and howling. <laughs> Sounds more like a puppy than a ghost. <clears throat> the ghost, all dressed in white, went up the hill to the house where he used to live. This house. He walked right through the wall and into the living room. Then he went up to the window and took off his head. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. And he's standing there now, staring at you. Go on. I dare you to turn around and look. OK. Oh. <gasps> oh. It's on fire! Call Fireman Sam. Ooh, a, a fire at Mike Flood's house. <laughs> There's a fire at the Flood's house, quick as you can. Is it Mike Flood's bonfire, sir? Probably. I expect it's got out of control. We're supposed to be going there after we come off duty. Yes, so uh, I might as well come with you. Well... The bonfire, is it, Mike? No, the fire's in the sitting room. Breathing apparatus on then, men. I needed to tie the other end of this rope to the floating jetty. OK, Sam. Don't worry, everyone. Graham and Sam will tow you back to the shore. Mercury's not powerful enough. Jetty from moving. Elvis, hold on to this. I'm going underwater. <gasps> no, no, no! Don't be fish food! Ready, Sam? Oh, 
We don't need team building exercises. We work perfectly together already. We're brilliant, we are. Oh, Mum, I didn't get to see the monster. I'm sure Sarah can tell us all about it. I didn't really see the monster. I just pretended to. But Sarah, you scared everyone and put them in a lot of danger. I know, Uncle Sam, I'm sorry. I won't ever tell stories again. But Sarah, why would you say such a thing? I wanted you to have lots of passengers on your train, Grandad. Well, don't worry, Sarah. I forgot how beautiful the mountains are. I know I'll be coming back here again on Gareth's train. Me too. And me. And us. Well, Gareth, looks like you're going to be a busy guy, eh? Happy Halloween. Have we got our trick-or-treating masks ready? I'm a scary witch. We <laughs> have dragons. <laughs> Boo! Well done. You all look very scary. Let's see if we can find some sweets then, shall we? Yay! Okay, Derek, you wait here. Um, which mask shall I use first? Ah! <laughs> Trick or treat! Oh, <laughs> hello, little vampire. My first visitor. Let's get you some sweets. There you go. Bye now. Bye! Monster! Oh, lots of monsters out tonight. Oh, well, that's all I've got left. Well, hey, look at all these sweets. So, uh, what do I do, Norman? Oh, uh, oh. oh dear. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Looks like I won't get to do any champion apple bobbing this year after all, Penny. <laughs> Not unless Elvis hurries up. I hope the trick or treaters are having more luck. Push, Derek! That's strange. No sweets left. But Halloween night's just started. How can we go trick-or-treating if there aren't any sweets? Oh, there must be some somewhere. Dillis, we've got a little problem. I don't suppose you've got any spare sweets at the shop. Three whole boxes? <laughs> Well, that's wonderful, Dennis. We'll be right along. So we're looking for a rock that's shaped like a hooked nose. There it is! And it looks really, really scary. Treasure hunters stop at nothing to find gold, James. Come on! But... What about the ghost? Don't worry. You just stay here, all by yourself. Copy that. Good job, Penny. You're really good at this. Over. Uh, yes, well, thanks, Ben. You're not so bad yourself. Anyway, over and spouse. I mean, out. Out. Uh, ah, ah, my eyes. And back down the steps I go. We're almost at the rock that's shaped like a hooked nose. I think we should go back. No way! Treasure hunters never give up. Oh, Norman! This way! This way! This way! Where are you? I can't see you. Norman? 
James, lunch. <gasps> oh, they've gone. Missing in the fog. Oh, my Norman. Don't worry, Dillis. They can't have gone far. I'll find them. Come in, Sam. Come in, Ben. Thick fog is rolling in from the west. Over. Copy that. This seems like a good time to test the foghorn. <laughs> I know. Back down. Again. Well, at least we know the foghorn works. Oh. 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 Ah! It's Bunty Bandy Pete's ghost ship! Ah! Get off me! Bandy Pete! And he's protecting his treasure! Ah! 